Google Sheets makes it easy to set a custom area as the print area in your workbooks. You can select single or multiple cells, a worksheet, or even an entire workbook to be printed. To do that, you'll have to first learn how to set the print area in Google Sheets. Set the print area to only print selected cells. If you have your data only in specific cells in your worksheet, you can configure an option so that Google Sheets only prints those selected cells. Launch a web browser on your computer, access Google Sheets, and open the workbook you'd like to print. Select the cells you want to print in your workbook. Choose File, Print from Google Sheets in the menu bar. Alternatively, press Ctrl and P in Windows or Command and P on Mac. Choose Selected Cells from the Print drop-down menu on the right. This ensures only the selected cells are printed. Now, select Next at the top of the screen. Follow the standard print process from here to print your cells. You can also set the print area to print the entire sheet. If your workbook has multiple worksheets and you'd like to print a specific worksheet, you can get Google Sheets to do just that. Open your workbook with Google Sheets in the web browser. Choose the worksheet you'd like to print at the bottom of your workbook. Now, select File, Print from the Google Sheets menu bar. Choose Current Sheet from the Print drop-down menu on the right. You'll see your current worksheets preview on the left. Select Next at the top and follow the standard print wizard to print your worksheet. You can, of course, set the print area to print the entire workbook. Sometimes, you may want to print your entire Google Sheets workbook, which could include multiple worksheets. Google Sheets has an option to do that too. When you print an entire workbook, make sure your printer has enough ink to print your data. Also, feed enough paper into your printer's paper tray to ensure there's no interruption when you print the workbook. First, access your workbook with Google Sheets in the web browser. Then, choose File, Print from Google Sheets in the menu bar. Select Workbook from the Print drop-down menu on the right. Now, choose All Sheets from the Selection drop-down menu. You'll see a preview of your entire workbook on the left. If this looks good to you, select Next at the top right corner. Next, you'll select your printer. Choose the paper size and other options to finally print your entire workbook. If your Google Sheets data is spread across multiple pages, you may want to include the headers on each page that you print. This makes reading the data easier as you know exactly what column is for what data on each page. To print column headers on each page, you'll first freeze the header row. Open your workbook and access the worksheet you want to print. Now select View, Freeze, one row from Google Sheets menu bar to freeze the first row in your worksheet. Following this, choose File, Print to configure the print options for your worksheet. Select Headers and Footers and enable Repeat Frozen Rows on the right. Customize any other options if you'd like, then select Next at the top right corner of the window. If you want to know how to set custom print areas with custom page breaks, check out the article linked in the description below. See you next time.